Focus on yourself means priorities your own desires, needs rather than those of other people's. That does not mean you are actively working against others. It simply means you are depleting yourself to make others happy. The problems being too much in social medias in every time you log, log into it, you find thousands and millions of information which belongs to uh, others' lives, how others talk, how others eat, how others live with their lives. You more focused others' lives. You will lose the value time that can be used to develop and create yourself so focus on yourself focus on your spirituality then you will feel that you are living as a human in this world what is the first thing in our mind before doing something what will others think of me if i do this there is a reason i think about other peoples we live in human society with many principles and morals that's why we see if i do these actions will harmful others or if i do that action will harmful others if you don't think about others before doing something it means you don't uh, care the welfare of of others. It is also good to think of others, but it is wrong only of think of others. It is affects your self-improvement. I would like to tell a story. First of all, you imagine that what I am telling you in your mind. A skill you don't know about that. That means singing, dancing, music composting, anything. You train that skill uh, three hours a week in eight months. At the end, in eight months, you will see some improvements in that skill. Improvise little by little like this and put yourself in the middle of the stage where thousands of people can see you. All the cameras are focused on you and two professionals in also in with you. How you feel uh, you are asked to compete with them in your uh, talent. Although we think we can do it boldly at first, after the first professional uh, finishes his performance after seeing the reaction of audience uh, we will reduce our boldness sometimes don't give our performance out of our fear that the audience will laugh at us but in the year 2000 the olympic uh, games were held sydney a man participated in the Olympic Games. If you look at his background, he did not know how to swim. But he is learning swim since eight months before his Olympic. Also, he could practice uh, for eight months, uh, three hours in a week. And practice is not enough. He go to river and sea to practice. All the fishermen also teach him. But he has learned so far not to drown in water. 
but somehow he practiced and hard works and went to the place where the olympics were held then uh, go there and look the 50 meter swimming pool the first time in his life life look the 50 meter swimming pool so he uh, got scared and then uh, but did not go down then jumped the uh, swimming pool then started the practice some people laugh and some people gave ideas uh, and teach him but practice it finally stopped at the spot and now time to jump and also two professionals also with him so there is fear in her mind then however two professionals made a small mistakes so they um, disqualified the man only uh, want to give a performance but you can say the man is lucky if he is give good performance he can wins but he has a fear the other things that i can't do it everyone laugh at it but he should not let he jump into the swimming pool and achieve the even through uh, swim slowly but he achieved the goal and created the own history this is what i am telling you what things have you been putting off for others what reasons are you afraid for others no one cares about you until unless you care yourselves start think about yourself start care about yourselves so try and fight nothing is impossible om shanti stay tuned to our youtube channels for spiritual experiences in all three languages